Additionally, the Salvation Army has deployed teams to regions hardest hit by the Alberta wildfires. Major Ben Lippers says he's been chatting with his teams while on his way to the fires. So we have a team up in High Prairie right now uh, feeding 500 people. Um, and uh, they're feeding them in four different locations. So they're transporting the meals to hotels because of mobility issues. And uh, so that's a team we have on ground right now. Uh, we have a team that's part of the ESS group up in um, Fort Mac area, and they are uh, on standby with that whole ESS team. Uh, they've been on standby for a bit now. Um, and we also have a group ready to go, ready to launch in um, High Prairie. Uh, but as you can uh, well imagine, the fire has jumped highways, has closed this highways. Best laid plans for tomorrow are changed in the middle of the night. So we're kind of going um, up and down on that spectrum. And we're in consultation with a group out in um, the western part of the province for us to go and help out at that uh, um, a reception center with food. Plus, these people are coming and they have nothing, and, and some of them have no means to get anything, like um, any any extras. They just don't have that capability. So they're talking to us about that, and uh, so we'll probably end up deploying there. Lithburg says all of the Salvation Army teams on scene have training specific to emergency disaster management. The team in Lethbridge is currently on standby and did exercises over the weekend with Lethbridge Police Service and Lethbridge and Area Search and Rescue.